I believe people can't see our symbols in our written history because we are programmed not to see. You have to open your brain and understand what you're looking at in order to see it. What I've learned from this video is that every time I watch something on this YouTube that has to do with, you can quote me if you want to, the essence of our black society, the essence of our black being, the us, it's got this link, this connection, this dark connection to the past. You have some entity, a group of people truly hate us because they were cast out. That has nothing to do with us. Their fight is with somebody else. And when you look at the signs that you see in these movies, these I call them I call them advertisements. They 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 show us pieces of what they want to happen or what is going to happen or what has happened already and it's right there plain right in the open right there in the open everything is right there where you can see it what better way to hide knowledge but to place it in front of people and not give them a reason to look for it. I only speak from my perspective. I'm getting a new education from watching some of these things on YouTube. It's a re-education because some of the things that I should have learned they need not apply. I mean, I mean they, they really don't they, they really don't have nothing to do with me all the stuff that I need to learn. But see, these all these things that you need to learn, you have to learn them. I don't care if it doesn't mean anything to you. If you have knowledge of it, that's a power that you have with it that you don't have because you don't know of it. You can't see the, the signs because you don't know what they are because they sit right there in front of you it's the, the symbolism the leaf on the bottle or the I don't know the stars on this bottle I mean, count them might be a certain number matter of fact the symbols that we wear the images that we we've seen over the course of our life we used to watch these old monster movies what were they telling us then? You see TV in the 80s. What were they teaching us? They taught us how to look at images. They taught us how to stare into a box. I remember when the boxes had no color. I remember seeing Popeye fight Bluto constantly. I remember Raj and Rerun, George and Wheezy, Bubba and Grady. I remember Archie Bunker. I remember uh, what was it? Opie Taylor. I remember Dr. Smith.
images, not education. He created a dummy box and we stare in it and we learn from it. Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. How many kids was talking like that after that movie? So they get through us through our corneas. They focus us on something else. The bait and switch. The false realities. And it's an old story that they never tell completely. Is the only story that we should have ever known. The story of how we got here. How this has come to be. That is the only story that's ever been important to all humanity. Those signs and symbols come way back from back in the time when that knowledge was still. Shit, everybody knows they came from. <laughs> we don't know where we came from as a species. We know it's been divided. Them, us, us and them. We've been split, genetically manipulated, reprogrammed, stupefied, dumbified, fried, lied, and laid to the side. We've been drilled, prodded, raped, controlled, defeated, rebuilt, destroyed again. And yet we still are here. They destroy us. They kill us. They've taken our bodies. They've become us. They manipulate us. They mate with us. They control us. But we are still here. You can't destroy what you have not created. You can't defeat what you have already killed. You cannot resurrect what has never been dead. You cannot make live life that has never been had. The meek shall inherit the earth. Not me, not you, not us, not them. Those who are totally innocent to this destruction of this world they shall destroy us through our own demise but we will still be here